All right, handwriting practice for hiragana. So please read the information that is here, and there are two options. There's the online version with Jamboard, and there's the printable PDF version, which you could print at home. I also have a couple here at CMS at the front office. All right, and we also have um, an additional piece in Duolingo to help you um, practice the character stroke order. So the first thing is to click on the link saying Learning Hiragana. In the flashcards, you would have been exposed to the um, stroke order if you had opened up the flashcards. But here you can click on the character and see the proper stroke order as well and how it's written. All right. And if you go back here, like I mentioned before, you have the option of the Jamboard or the PDF. If you go into the Jamboard, you'll notice that you have about 19 slides. This first one is just going over the directions on how to use Jamboard and navigate through it. And then you have the arrows up here to go between your frames. And you can pinch the screen to zoom in after you choose your writing tool. So I recommend using the highlighter tool. It just gives it a little bit more of that almost calligraphy-like look. But if you prefer using any of the others, just whatever works best and comfortable. And you want to practice doing the correct stroke order, as you see in these examples. I would recommend on this first line, repeating the stroke order, one, two, three, four, or final one. Um, and then down here, just writing ah uh, over and over and over. And then you can practice also on this baseline without the four squares to um, work on your stroke order. And then you just go through the remaining tabs. And when you complete them all, you can follow how to turn this in. So um, from the student perspective, if you view the assignment, there will be an option off to the right or bottom, depending if you're on a mobile device, to turn it in. Now, if you are part of the Duolingo, Duolingo group, You'll notice that when you go into Duolingo, there's an area at the top that says characters. You can choose Hiragana, and then you can learn the characters, and they'll have you practice writing it as well here. If you want me to go through and uh, get feedback from your handwriting options, then you do need to complete this form here so that I know when and where to check um, who's completed it. Otherwise, I'm not going to go into each and um, every person's uh, Jamboard or if they have done the um, packet unless I get that form for review. And the same thing would be down here in the Katakana practice. All right.